boys and girls, so we have been talking a lot about creating. And this morning in our morning message, we talked about how to create a book using paper. So look here, I have a book with just that. And what we're gonna do today is we're gonna take this really big detailed book and we're gonna put it in a story walk, which means we're gonna look at each page, decide what it's about, and draw each picture. So you're going to help me do that today, okay? I know it's a, a li sorry. I know it's a little difficult because um, you know this is a video, so you know I might not be exactly drawing what you're saying, but we'll talk about it, okay? And you can always keep drawing at home. So if you want to do this, you could also listen to the story again and draw your own story walk. This is called a story walk, okay? Now we're gonna do it with this. This way to pre-K. We're gonna take a book that's already written and we're gonna use our creative frames to make it shorter and more simple for us. This story is called This Way to Pre-K. Come with me, let's run, let's play. Fun times are waiting. This way to pre-K. Hmm, okay, so here's our first page. What should we draw here? Yes, look how she's feeling. She's feeling really happy. So maybe that could be our first one. So first she's feeling happy. Why is she feeling happy? Yeah, cause she's going to pre-K. She's so excited. It's gonna be super fun. She's so excited for pre-K. Here's the next one. This is my teacher. Her name is Miss Renee. She greets me at the door at the start of each day. So they're greeting each other. What does it mean to greet? Yes, to say hello, good morning. What do we do when we say good morning? You can shake hands, but in the morning, since we don't, we don't see each other in person, what do we do via Zoom? Right, we wave and say good morning. So let's go ahead and draw a hand that's waving, ready? One, two, three, four, five. And I'm gonna draw these little dashes to know that we're, that we're waving. And it says, hi, good job. Morning circle is how we begin. Today is Tuesday, I say to my friend. So what are they doing here? Yes, the morning message, just like we do. Hmm, how could we draw this? Okay, yeah, I think you could do that too. We could maybe just draw a piece of paper and some squiggles. So here's the morning message. And we're gonna write, today is Tuesday. Good job, so she's super excited. We say hello, then we do the morning message. Wow, this is a great story walk. Olivia helps with story time. We're learning new words and discovering rhyme. Let's dance with ribbons. Look at them fly. When you hear your color, wave it high. So they're reading a book and they're dancing. Hmm, do we dance? Yes, we do. So maybe we could draw how we're dancing. What do you say? Perfect, so I'm gonna draw. I'm doing a stick figure, kids, for the purposes of time, but I'm gonna Draw my stick figure, wacha, wacha, dancing, woo! Good job, here's our next one. Here, I meet my friends Claire, Antonio, and Paul, Chattel, and Michael, I like them all. What are they doing here? Right, they're outside on the playground. What's your favorite thing to do on the playground? Yeah, I love to do the swings and the slide. Let's go ahead and draw a slide. Look, here's the ladder and the slide. So yeah, after dancing, you know, they went outside to play. And they're still playing, here we go. With, uh, okay. So then, it's lunchtime now. I smell something yummy, burritos and fruit to fill up my tummy. It's such a big kid, I can fill my own cup. If I spill, it's no problem. I just wipe it up. So now they're at lunchtime. What do they do at lunchtime? Yep, they're eating and drinking milk. So I'm gonna draw a cup of milk. Here's my cup with milk. And I'll just do some pizza because Ms. Alasha loves that pizza. Awesome. 
And centers we build and discover and think, will this piece of wood float or sink? Wow, we do blocks and paint and all of that too. This is center time like you do your choice for. I'm gonna draw, um, what, am I, what was I gonna draw? Oh, I'm gonna draw a house made of blocks. So I might use a square and a triangle. And I'm doing blocks because I'm at center time. And that's the end. Then we'll talk about what we did today. What was your favorite thing? Was it climbing or digging or playing pretend? Was it singing or reading or making new friends? I've had so much fun and I hope you did too. The best part of my day was spending it with you. Look here, how is she, ha how is she feeling now? Yes, she's so happy. So we can end the story exactly how we started it. So happy. Because we had a great day at Freak Day. All right, so now this is called a storyboard. Look, we told a story by taking this really long book and making it really short. We can tell the story, the same story, just by looking at these pictures, right? When we came to 3K, we were just feeling super excited. And then what did we do? We said, hi. Then it was time for the morning message. And then we danced. Then it was time to go outside, eat lunch, play in centers, and then it's the end of the day and we're feeling so happy. Now, boys and girls, we did this because we just wanted to show that you can, there's a lot going on in this story and we can make it shorter and easy for us to tell it by drawing out each page so that it's a little bit easier and we can really describe it. So thank you so much for helping me this uh, morning, afternoon, whatever time of the day it is, and we'll see you soon. Good job.